Do you know that Prince came, hailed people here. He looked, he saw Dorothy. He now went to go and turn on that turn. Like he literally turned back and did not say what to Dorothy. Hey. Hey homie, welcome back to my channel. How you doing? What's it happening? My name is Omi Odiki and this is Talk to Your Homie TV, my darling here. I love to give very sweet and juicy gifts to finally maybe Nanja reunion is your poor nuts. That's finally come. You get me? Like everybody has been waiting for the 17th of June. Like when is it going to come? Literally, we have finally come to that day and we watch the reunion and it's crazy. Less than 10 minutes that the housemates are together just already drama left right and center from dorothy and prince from everybody literally from katrina from who as in it's just mad it's mad it's mad so yeah subscribe to this channel because see i'm going to be analyzing the whole reunion show from start to finish you get me now let's begin so what happened was first of all everybody looked so beautiful everyone their makeup their hair everything looks superb my gosh they all came in like set by set here yeah. I think the first set that came was Brito, Brito, Eric, um, Dorothy, and Katrina were the first set to come in here. Yeah? And after that, Lucy came with the next set, yeah? but particularly Lucy and Katrina. When Lucy stepped in here, yeah, Lucy stylishly ignored Katrina, as into the extent that Katrina had to shout and say, Ah, Lucy, I'm saying hello. I'm looking like, wait, till the drama is really, really on, and they carry the drama to reunion. It even gets crazy because, see, I noticed that you know Ozo was also giving Dor. I like once they come in, cause you know I, I mean as you come in now, people who are already there will help people that who are coming. Like ah, what's up? Will you get me? Ozo was also giving Dorothy like you know they do you not know, greet like that. You get me? Kid Wire is one gentleman I beg because as anybody comes in, Kid Wire is getting up. Literally, Boba is getting up and he's hailing you and he's not, you get me? But the one that was very smelling, round, fact, I smelled it there from the television to my room, you get me? It was Prince and Dorothy. Hey, that was just crazy. Like when Prince K stepped in, Dorothy was sitting down on this, on this side here. Yeah? Do you know that? Prince came, hailed people here. He looked, he saw Dorothy. He now went to go and turn on that turn. Like he literally turned back and did not say what to Dorothy. Hey, jeez, jeez, jeez. OMG. Anyway, so everybody comes except Kaisha and Erica. They were not uh, like available for this for the first day. And everybody kind of starts to ask the juicy questions. You get me? First of all, I liked how he like how they replayed events that happened in the house. So imagine the housemates watching themselves cry, all the kisses, all the fights, everything. When they finish playing that now, everybody kind of asks Tochi, are you happy to see Katrina? Tochi look, 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 he said, hmm, people come, happy to see Katrina. Katrina said, hey, even has to, she's happy to see Tochi. Then I asked Dorothy. Now see, when Ibuka asked um, Katrina and Tochi, uh, like, are they happy to see each other? Dorothy was like, ah, no, you sure, she was very, like, no more Dorothy, now, lively, bubbly, very loud. Then did not ask her, are you happy to see Prince? Eh? Dorothy's voice went, like, from level 10 to level 2, like, mm, yeah, I mean, like, I mean, here, here, here to be here. They said, no, we're asking you, are you happy to see Prince? And said, I mean, yeah, he has to be here now, so <laughs> she's happy to see him. Hey, I say, oh, more we will chill. Even Lilo had to say, we'll get to the drama, don't worry. See, me, eh, I'm here for the drama. I really want to know what happened between Dorothy and Prince. Because how? Like, how did they get? Like, see, I'm not even about to start making a suspicion, assumption. No, the reunion has started. We'll finally get to the bottom of the matter. Because if Dorothy is already giving drama, if Prince is ignoring Dorothy, me, I want to hear what really happened. Next now, let's talk about how classy Nengi was because see, when they asked her like, okay Nengi, what do you expect from this reunion? She was like, see, all she wants is just for them to come here, speak their truths and move on. That's literally all she's here for. I'm like, yeah, baby, that's what you're here for. You get me? Oh, um, I told anybody you say, what are you, what classy? See, that she has come to clear the air, speak her truth, confront who needs to be confronted here. Yeah? And you know, there are some narratives about her name. You get me? That she also wants to come and clear that air. Let her tell us, you know, what really happened. Like the truth about everything. And anybody who like is giving her energy, she will give you the energy back. Plus Twitter fingers. I'm like, who had Twitter fingers? I mean, I just feel like any shit is dropping. She's dropping it at V. That's what I feel. Because I mean, who had Twitter fingers? I don't know. But you kind of ask Kid like you are you call because on Twitter you were one person who was very like vocal on Twitter. What do you like hope to achieve from this reunion? Kid Wire is like, see, he doesn't have any issue with anybody, that he's happy to see most people that are here. But listen, Kid Wire is just oh my god. He now said, mm. but you know, like he's been traveling around. Hey, he's been traveling around, so you know he just got back and ah, 
daughter say, ah, well, for who no travel. Like, even her she has been traveling around. I mean, she went to Kenya. I say, it's, you know, it's, it's, it's funny how they are still giving themselves the same energy that they had, you get me, like in the house. The person who had the energy, I, I forgot to even mention, was Katrina. Katrina came with the energy, like when, um, so it was Neo Ozo Nengi, and I've forgotten the first person that came here, when they stepped in, Katrina did not even, like, she did not even, she just carried her face like it was, like one kind, ah, ah. She didn't even, she didn't even try to say hello to them. She's like, well, y'all moved, you Next now, when, um, I think the last set, Sha came, Sha, um, Katrina was like, oh, well, y'all are stepping on my dress, Joe. Eh, based on say, you get me, that dress is like a million dollars. How are you step on your Who are you? Katrina, see, like, you see that energy that she had in the house where she was like feeling like, you know, she's a boss bee, everything, like nobody's on a level. That is the same energy she's on. And, you know, I finally come to realize something, yeah. If that's who she is, it's really okay. You know, I've come to realize that maybe we should not put like our own, personality on people of course that personality is smelling if you ask me but that's what she is it's okay if she feels like she's bigger than everybody no problem man so people can ask like katrina you what's your like what do you want to achieve from this reunion she's like see she left the house in two like the first two weeks when the show started and so she knows that some people have mixed feelings about her so she wants to clear the air and the few people that she thinks deserves her friendship she wants to have a conversation with them there were like a few people katrina was like yeah man few people man few Hey, energy. And that was now where it ended. But listen, just after it ended, they now showed us upcoming like events that will happen and it felt like everybody was attacking Ozo. Dorothy was first telling Ozo, like, first of all, Ozo, like, do you know how stupid it is that you will come and meet me to tell me your problems? I will advise you. You go and tell the person who you're coming to report to me. Obviously, that was the whole Nengi and Ozo's, you know, clash. You know, Dorothy and Ozo, and this is something that is amazing because when we saw the clip from Bibi Ninja, I think I can, I, I don't know if I can play the clip. I mean, the comment section, people were dragging Dorothy. And I'm just like, why would you? Like, they were dragging her, they were insulting her. Oh, that did Ozo promise her? Because um, she, she actually said, Ozo, you sit down here to talk about friendship. You that you come and meet me to report someone to me. And when I advise you, you can tell the person what I said. You get me? And people were dissing Dorothy that, eh, did Ozo promise her marriage? Was that? Uh, I'm looking like, man, y'all relax. If you have a faith, no, nobody says you should not have a faith. But like, when you see speed, call it speed. When you see white, call it white. If I, if you have a friend, yeah, that will come, you know the kind of friend, they're sneaky. In fact, those people should not be your friends. That will come and meet you to tell you about this person tell you about this person how this person is very ha ha and you give the person your own opinion the person will now go and carry the matter that's a very smelly behavior now do you get me so i uh, went were dissing dorothy i'm looking like why are you dissing her it makes no sense to me i'm like why <laughs> me me you know what uh, dorothy and ozo i really want to, I, I really want them to talk about like their whole scenario and i really hope that ozo has ca will be able to see that what he did was just borderline annoying I'm wrong, you get me, and um, oh, see, eh? If anybody cut my say, oh, me, eh, because I don't care, let's call a spade a spade. What Ozo did to Dorothy was wrong, simple and short, you get me. And I also saw part of the like upcoming clips was when um, Katrina was telling Ozo, oh. I think they were arguing about something. I'm not sure. But Katrina was like, eh, Ozo, what are you saying? You were actually in my room. Afterwards, you came to my room. I don't know what the argument was about. For me, I want to just hear all the tea. Let me put the disclaimer. Because, of course, this day was just basically introduction. Bringing them all in. From tomorrow, we're not entering to the main, 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 bass, boss, biggie, see, eh? Nothing is personal. Do you understand? Even the housemates are ready for basbos. When they ask Tochi, Tochi says he's happy to see his friends and his foes. There's obviously drama amongst all the housemates. So if I say anything, let no fan come and take it personal. I mean, I don't even care. And just remember that after this reunion, there's very high possibility that there will be a new set in that will, like there will be a new like we've been a jazz season. You get me? So don't take it personal. I will speak my truth and say what I want to say. You get me? But that is the reunion. So far, I am so excited. If you want to watch all the videos from the reunion, my Instagram page, talk to your homie TV. There's no reason you should not go there. You get me? I will put the link down below. My Instagram page, talk to your homie TV. Yeah? Go there, honey. Eh? 
and watch all the videos because as i'm watching i'm actually even going live and then i'll now post the clips of everything that happened on instagram like the party is happening everywhere i actually like intend to give you guys tea left right and center so if you know what's good for you go and subscribe to my instagram page my darling and share this video please yeah, anybody who is not in nigeria you owe me haha <laughs> oga share this video to them i beg so that they can know that this is where all the tea goes down on that note i'm going to say peace out i love you guys so i am happy literally eh about this reunion i'm so i've been waiting bro i've been waiting for the juice like what i'm happy about it i love you guys so much as well and don't forget i have the best and sweetest vlog channel ever it's called talk to your homie vlog guys there i show you guys what i do behind the scene my life in abuja how i'm living the baby girl lifestyle i just dropped like in my latest weekly vlog ah oh, man i had my first luxury shopping like ex my first expensive luxury item i bought it in my last vlog i showed you guys everything about it you want to watch that one i'll link that one down below my darling go and watch it i love you guys so much thank you for watching Bye -bye.